Good evening, viewers. My name is Sanjeev Banger. I'm a regional manager of marketing with Focus College Canada. And uh, today we are doing this uh, Facebook live session with uh, Fly Abroad Immigration to help uh, students know more about Focus College Canada, its courses, the ongoing offers for January 2021 intake, which is already open for admissions, our admissions criteria, and uh, how team at uh, Fly Abroad Immigrations will help you get through the admissions process and what all benefits can you avail while you are studying at Focus College Canada through their university degree pathway programs. So we will just take a few seconds to let few more people join us so that more and more people can be benefited from the information. So we will just take like uh, five seconds and then we will start. <clears throat> Thank you for being patient and uh, now we start again. So, Good evening people, my name is Sanjeev Bangar. I'm a regional manager of marketing with the Focus College Canada. And today we are here with the Fly Abroad Immigrations on their Facebook page to help uh, more and more students know about uh, Focus College Canada, their programs, their ongoing offers for January 2021 intake, our uh, application fee waived uh, for all the programs so that, that we will be operating for our January intake. And we'll also let you know about uh, the courses that you can pick up here and uh, the pathway programs to 75 universities globally, including seven universities within Canada. So to start with, uh, let me just introduce uh, Focus College Canada to you. We are located in British Columbia, Canada. It's in the west of Canada and uh, in the southern part of British Columbia state, we have our campus in Kelowna and Surrey. So Kelowna, a not so talked about uh, place, it's located in the Okanagan Valley, and the city is located, located on the lake shores of Okanagan Lake. Our first campus started here in 1992, and post the success that we have got here, we opened another campus in Surrey. And today, we are operating at both the campuses with a total intake capacity of more than 800 students per intake. And talking about our affiliations, so we are a DLI, so we are very much approved uh, to invite international students to study with us. We are EQA approved institution. So our college has got EQA approval, that is Education Quality Assurance Body in British Columbia, as well as uh, we provide dual certification with the help of SQA. So we are the pioneer institute for SQA education in Canada. We were the first one to get this SQA certification for our courses here. So talking about our courses, we are providing you the university degree pathway programs in business computing, that software development, a part of IT, and travel and tourism. So all the students uh, who are pursuing currently in arts or commerce, non-medical, they have uh, definite courses available for them. For the students from medical stream who are looking forward to switch from medical to something different, they can come to us to study travel and tourism with us. A very popular subject, a very popular domain to work at. Talking about our upcoming intake here, and I'll also take you through this qualification uh, standard that we've talked about through EQA, and I'll uh, surely let you know about SQA as well. So Scottish Qualification Authority, SQA, that is uh, in collaboration with our college, and uh, we are providing you dual certification for every course that you are joining with us. So supposedly, if you come to us and uh, you join us for a two-year program, that is advanced diploma in, let's say, business, so you'll be getting a definite access to seven partner universities. And at any of the partner universities, you can uh, continue your studies further based on uh, the grades that you have got here and the credits that you have received for the previous education. So we have 75 universities all across the globe. Those are already in collaboration with us. And uh, here talking about uh, the universities, those are available in Canada. So we have seven Canadian universities on board with us. So namely, University of the Fraser Valley, the Royal Roads University, University of Vancouver Island, University of Prince Edward Island, uh, University Canada West, Thompson River University, and Trinity Western University. So seven very prestigious universities in uh, Western Canada are already there in collaboration with us and uh, talking about the pathway. So I'll just give you an insight, uh, a slight insight about this. When you start a program at Focus College in business, you complete that program. Now you have an option to move to Royal Roads University for BBA in uh, entrepreneurial management or uh, to uh, 
University of Fraser Valley for their program that's BBA that's uh, business administration or BIS that is bachelor's in integrated studies so there you already have your credits mapped if you're going to BBA at uh, University of the Fraser Valley you will be getting 43 credits and you move into the fourth semester similarly if you're picking up a BIS bachelor's in integrated system you get 60 credits and you move into the fifth semester with Royal Roads University as well, the same pattern will follow and you'll be getting access into the third year based on the grades that you have attained here. So that is absolutely subject to availability of uh, seats and uh, your performance in your first two years of education. And with this, surely you will be able to get access to the university program. Post that, you will also be eligible for your work permit, which will be there for three years. So PGWP or PSW or uh, postgraduate postgraduation work permit that we call so that will be available once you have completed the entire program of four years and you'll be getting three years PGWB. Now I'll take you through the eligibility criteria. So it's very liberal and moderate eligibility criteria that we are talking about. Starting from academics, uh, we ask for 50% overall in academics. And if we are talking about IELTS, so we are looking at 6.0 overall, where you, you will be accepted if you have 5.5 in one module. So triple six five point five uh, with fifty percent in academics, you can enroll yourself at Focus College Canada for one of our programs. Uh, those will be providing you university degree pathways, and from here you start your journey to end up uh, with your selection at one of the partner universities. Moving ahead, uh, talking about the admissions process. So once you have just assessed yourself uh, with the initial eligibility criteria so you can reach out to the team of uh, fly abroad immigration and they will help you go ahead with this process where they will be filling the online application form for you along with sending your documents uh, to our admissions team we will be issuing you the conditional letter of acceptance within 24 hours and after you have received the conditional letter of acceptance along with the student enrollment contract you are required to send us a signed copy as soon as we receive the signed copies we will be issuing you the letter of acceptance within five business days. So this also includes your fee payment once these necessary steps have been done. So the team at uh, Fly Abroad Immigration knows the application process really well. So once you reach there, they will be able to help you out with all the minute details you might be interested in knowing there. Moving ahead, you have got your LOA. So what are the benefits of uh, studying at uh, Focus College Canada and uh, why should as a student or as an individual you should look at Focus College Canada only? So as I talked about our university degree pathway program, I'll also talk about why it is so important to enroll at a bachelor's degree course and uh, not look for a two-year diploma program, specifically post-secondary diploma program. So every student uh, moving out from here is looking forward to a wonderful career in Canada. Obviously, they are aspiring in terms of their careers. Otherwise, uh, they can obviously they can move to any part and uh, Canada is one of the most loved countries that is uh, one of the most livable places have always been there and it's uh, we can say most aspiring nation for us as well. <clears throat> so the students moving ahead from here to Canada completing their education they have to undergo a CRS ranking system so that is called as comprehensive ranking system where all your education, your age, your English speaking abilities, everything is measured and uh, they're assessed based on certain marks that are provided for each of these. So to gain a permanent residency there, you need to undergo that CRS assessment where if you are completing your education with a two year diploma program after completing your class 12th in India, you will be ending up uh, somewhere close to 410, 420 at max 430 points on CRS system. Whereas a graduate who will be completing a bachelor's degree here will be getting 37 extra points compared to a bachelor's, uh, compared to a diploma pass out student. And uh, the student coming out from the bachelor's degree will be ending up at 460 probably, 467 probably if they are, uh, the other students are at 430. So this increases your chances of uh, getting a confirmed uh, residence status. So here you will be so when I'm talking about this is increasing the chances, uh, certainly I'm not saying that it is going to get you. 
So this is increasing your chances and this is also increasing your chances of having a better career. When we are talking about career prospects, they will always be better when we are talking about higher educated uh, candidates. So if you are looking at someone uh, who has completed 12th and completed a, uh, a two-year program compared to a student who has completed uh, schooling as well as, as also completed uh, the college education with a bachelor's degree in hand. So the other person who has got uh, this four years of formal education of bachelor's degree will always be preferred. So as a student, when you have completed two year diploma program, you can also create your profile. But uh, this entire thing would just be on hold until and unless you are receiving the ITA. We are talking about ITA, that is invitation to apply. We all can create a profile, but uh, only who will be cracking the CRS score, whose score uh, that, that falls under the number that's crossing the number coming out in the draw, which is there every 15 days. So those only will be receiving this ID invitation to apply and they are onwards your application to residency that before that it is just a profile that you have created and assessed nothing else talking of PR I'll also like to tell you you will be requiring eight triple seven so you'll be requiring eight bands and listening module and seven in the other three when you are initiating your application as as a permanent resident there so this is to apply this is yet not finalized. So you have to work a lot. The, the, these are the places where your education will be helping you a lot. When you're studying there for four years, you will be getting a lot of experience with the Canadian culture, and that will be helping you, obviously, further with your jobs and your uh, life there in Canada. Now, talking about the other offer going on here. So we are not charging any application fee. We have waived our application fee for our upcoming January intake. And we are also offering students a bursary of 7,000 Canadian dollar. So when I'm talking about 7,000 Canadian dollar bursary, I would like to remind you that you have to complete the two year program with Focus College, taking a progression into the university degree to complete, uh, to get this complete bursary. Otherwise, if you are dropping your uh, studies in between if you are just quitting from the college uh, after completion of first year or something your entire bursary that will be rolled out and that will just be withdrawn so you'll not be getting the benefits of uh, this bursary now let me just help you understand how this bursary helps after applying this bursary to your total uh, fee to be paid in two years your total fee to be paid uh, comes out to 19,380 Canadian dollars subsequently divided into two years of your education. So in the first year, you only need to pay 9,500 Canadian dollars to start your education. And to pursue further from the second year, you only need to pay 9,880 Canadian dollars. So in less than $10,000 a year, you're getting uh, the start of your formal graduation education here in Canada. And further to that, you can uh, always take up the progression at one of the partner universities in Canada, which I told. Apart from this, this is not limiting you to Canada only. So Focus College is actually opening ways to you to enter into the United States for education, to go to United Kingdom, to pursue your bachelor's further, or maybe if you are interested in moving ahead to Australia or New Zealand as well. Maybe someone uh, who's looking for a particular course and Singapore and South Korea also, they can take benefits of this. We have more than 40 universities in United Kingdom alone where you can take this progression and complete your education. Please remember this all is subject to your grades you have attained in first two years of college. So talking about the classes structure and uh, the operational hours, so you will be having a classroom of uh, 15 to 20 students and you will be having your classes uh, twice a week. So that uh, generally happens to be Monday and Tuesday for the first batch and uh, Thursday and Friday for the others. So that's like uh, uh, and the first two days you'll be studying or the other two days you'll be studying. You'll be getting ample of your time in hand to work as uh, a part time, like you, you, a part time worker there. You can always look forward to your career opportunities there. Stable options will be available for you because you will be available five days a week to any job or maybe if you're talking about five hours a day if you work you can work legally 20 hours a week and that makes it four days even if you're taking a day off so you'll be having ample of time to work and get settled and obviously you can uh, look forward to better opportunities pursuing your career into the same field talking about the career options uh, for students who are completing their